another Sunday at the farmer's market. And this time it's super packed. Pro tip, when you come to the farmer's market, bring your own bag. So one of our favorite spots is the kombucha spot. If you return the bottles, you get some dollars back. I was about to text you to make sure you're coming. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, 15 to total, please. 32 bottles back. Whoa. You want to go visit our favorite cheese guy? Yeah, let's get some cheese. <laughs> so this is our favorite cheese guy. He also sells pickles. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Is it a football game today? The Dolphins are playing. Oh, wow. So, yeah, it's, it's pretty good. Look at the little chubby. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Zach the Baker right here. To make sure the ceviche hasn't run out yet. Uh, yeah. The ceviche is like Maybe. one of the best Maybe ceviche not. in the whole of Miami. Guacamole is good too. More ceviche? Aww. Ran out of ceviche. At least there's guacamole. We ended up getting two guacamoles since there's no ceviche. So sad. Look at those cuties! Let's spoil the dogs and see what we can, some kind of treat we can get them. Maybe we can get a. Yeah, I'm down to get that. Look at this giant jackfruit. These empanadas are the best. Thank you. Bye-bye. Got a pumpkin spice coffee. Make a whole. Mm-hmm. They got the acai bowls. They got tacos now. And they got popcorn. And they got barbecue. I got popcorn. I caved and got the cheddar caramel popcorn. So. So the farmer's market is open every Sunday from I think 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Yeah. So definitely check it out. It's one of the best farmer's markets in Miami. We pretty much always get cheese from the cheese guy, kombucha from the kombucha people, <laughs> and ceviche, but it ran out today, and yeah. guacamole. So. And when Beehaven's there. And there's a farm called Beehaven that right now is, I guess they're... They're growing. They're, they're growing, growing their, their, vegetables. their vegetables right now, so they're gonna come back soon, but they're one of the best farms when it comes to getting like organic vegetables and fruits and all of that, so. And goat milk. Yeah. <laughs> this is the Mata Hari empanada. It's Spanish chorizo and cheese and. Onions. And onions. And it's one of the, I mean, we've, we've tried several of the empanadas and I think this is one of the best ones. So you can see it's, it's um, Spanish chorizo caramelized onions and cheese inside it's like slightly sweet but it's also like cheesy and it's like it's just good so oh i just missed it but the leaves were falling and it felt like fall for a quick second in miami the leaves were falling well this little area here does look very fall all the leaves on the floor you get a new bone how's your new bone you like it is that your new favorite bone let me see it coco let me see is that your bone? He's gonna growl at me if I take it. I'm gonna bite my finger. Okay. No, he's a good boy. He doesn't. He doesn't do that. <laughs> No, it's not tutorial. We don't know what we're doing. So we're gonna try our best and see if we actually can make a pineapple jack-o-lantern. So basically, according to my uh, research, we need to cut this pineapple. Yeah, right here, right? Yes, around there. Now this pineapple is a little old. Yeah. Does it smell bad to you, like sour? No. I think it smells okay. I don't know how long does it take for pineapples to get bad, but I bought this maybe like not even a whole week ago. I wonder maybe. if it's gonna make it easier to cut into. Maybe. I bought it maybe like a, maybe a week ago right. at the most. So remember in the video we saw, it was like you they, they said that you should carve it as an X. You see it? So, big so here we'll put some of the pineapple. And you gotta go in a circle. Okay. So 
So then. Now, we, should we get a, an ice cream scooper? I think if we just like, if we like stab it. No, it's not gonna just pop out. No. <laughs> this is not that easy to come out. Take it out in chunks. <laughs> Doesn't work. This is harder than a, a pumpkin, right? You think so? I think so, right? Well, we haven't done a pumpkin yet, so we have to compare. But a pumpkin's more fun because it's more gratifying because you actually get to use your hands and rip it out. <laughs> You get to actually use your hands and rip the pumpkin. No, then we did it last seeds. year, right? I think, yeah, we did. And then I like to roast the pumpkin seeds, and I'm excited to. Go, go! It's just that we we don't have a pineapple core thing. I mean, most people, people don't have that. Yeah, I know, but the, the tutorials we saw, people just, yeah. for some reason, they all had a pineapple core. 20 seconds. I still got Look at all that to juice. Go. Is it okay? Mmm. Yeah? Yeah. It tastes like a pineapple Dole Whip. Oh my god, we should do, use this to make like pineapple Dole Whip, like homemade. The, that's the ice Disney. cream, right? The Disney, like, it's not ice cream, it's like a, a sherbet or whatever. Right. It's it's actually vegan. It's just straight up pineapple. Okay. Frozen pineapple? But I think, maybe there's something they add. I don't know. There's something else in it. Yes, ice? I don't know. Pineapple juice and ice and blend. Show like how it's still have some more to go. Almost done. We can work with that, right? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. down. Woohoo! Does that work? Yeah. It looks good. Uh oh. <laughs> Alright. So now we need the mouth. So how, okay. how should we make the mouth? Should it be like, should he be happy? Should he be like... <laughs> Well, Traditional, like should we, we just have? also the nose? No, there's no nose on this one. There's no nose. I don't think we're gonna have space for a nose. Unless we changed his mouth and did it more like um. We have to do like a. We could do like a O mouth where it has like an O on the side or. Hmm. So I think we we should try to make him as traditional as possible. So I think right here needs to be the nose and then down here the mouth. And I think the nose is just basically another eye. I think if we had maybe a, a fresher Yeah, this one's pineapple. like kind of breaking on flimsy. us. Mm. Okay, let's skip the nose and go right to the mouth. Wilson. Look at this. Right? Wilson from Castaway. Yeah. Like, where's the mouth? <laughs> <laughs> no, we had to fix this. He looks like a, a golem. Oh my goodness. Uh oh. Hey, look, he's getting happier. The reason on camera, it looks like it already has a light inside. I know, it. on camera you can actually, but in real life, well, in real life we can kind of see it. Let me make his smile a little more up. Joker-like. <laughs> like, hello. So then, all you do... Can you uh, cut off a little bit more? Make the space a little bit bigger. You want to try? Let's see. <laughs> it's not the prettiest one, but you know what? It... There we go. Let me close this. And we bake some pineapple. <laughs> uh, 
how come you can't see his mouth as much? Oh, there. We need to get like a toothpick. Hold it oh open. yeah, let's do that. It has a nose. Yeah, by accident. We didn't even plan that. Now, whoops. maybe when you put this on, you'll be able to tell. And oh, it looks cool. Bit. Here's all the pumpkin leftover. Good pumpkin. Oops. Here's all the pineapple gut leftover. Want some pineapple? Let's go take them outside.